If you saw the show a couple of weeks ago, our next guests really need no introduction. But in case you didn't, our next guests actually host a cooking show on public access TV in Maryland. And it's, well, it's like nothing that you've ever seen before, especially on the Food Network. Here for their unique brand of cooking and some breaded bacon that I actually have tasted, and it's unbelievable. The Feasty Boys, Feasty John and Feasty Jim. Guys, hey, great good morning. Great to be back. Great hey, to be Jay, back. How you doing? Doing well. We figured that, you know, it's breakfast time in the morning, so we're going to do a little. Morning, we need to do breakfast food. I got a little, you know? let's do it up. I got a little something to say about this morning stuff, man. <laughs> yeah, you're not a fan, are well, you? Well, we don't have a whole lot of breakfast foods, you know, because we're really not up that early. Yeah, usually what time do you guys wake <laughs> we're up? We're brunch, usually? guys. <laughs> I tell you, the last time I was up this early, the doctor was patting my bottom, telling my mother, it's a boy, it's yeah, a boy. I believe me. I, I know the feeling. We need to give you a little snack. We call oh, this I love a snack snacks. because we like snacking while we're cooking. Yeah, that's, that's a good idea. An so. original that's called feasty breaded bacon. And basically, what you do is you take, you know, bacon right out of the package. Uh -huh. You throw equal parts flour, brown sugar, and about a tablespoon of pepper in a bag. Throw your raw bacon in it. Shake it up. Get it good and coated. Put it on a cookie tray. Throw it in the oven at 350 for, for about bacon. 50. 15, 20 minutes, and it comes out. It gets this nice, crisp outside on it. It is unbelievable, the flavor. Shaken it's bacon. It's and like it's healthy, too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you'll, be, you'll be needing uh, some Lipitor after this. Actually, I got to say, this is the best bacon I've ever had. I'm embarrassed to say it because I know it can't be very good for you, but <laughs> yeah, it well, is it is phenomenal. I'm going to eat that whole we're the epitome of health here. And, 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 you, know, yeah. you can't eat like this all the time and maintain <laughs> bodies like this. Happens, yeah, you know? How do you guys keep your fingers? Like Bacon, right? <laughs> no, you guys look great. It's, it's you fit the carrots, part, you know? And wait. <laughs> So what is this? That's this is great called the. Uh, some people call it cream chip beef. It's really called SOS. Military it's SOS. Military SOS. Oh, I know what that stands for. Uh, it's something on a shingle. Something oh so good. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, because we're on uh, TV, we have already browned off um, maple sausage. Maple sausage. And yeah, ground beef. Of, yeah, tube uh -huh. of uh, maple sausage and about a pound of ground beef and some onion. Onion. So that's all that's in here right now, along with. Some beef bouillon, powdered beef bouillon. So okay. you want to throw about a couple tablespoons per what John just said. I don't now even gonna, know what that is, but now I, we're just going to take some flour and you dump You're it not all draining around. Draining the fat off of it or anything. You're leaving well, it in there. Of course there. not. That's the best part. Well, that's where all the flavor is. <laughs> yeah. Now if you there throw you that that flour in there like Jim just did, you're almost creating what's called a roux. It's going to make that meat nice and pasty. So you're, you're going to see it. It's going to get you know real pasty and stick together. Then when he throws the milk in. It's going to make it a nice, there, huh? thick, thick gravy. And that's, gravy. of course, uh, whole milk, right? Whole milk. Yeah, we're not using any of the <laughs> yes. low-fat products on this program, no. baby. Yeah. Just bark the cow in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> we're straight out of the cow. So you're okay. going to let that cook down, and then we've got some finished stuff. You take a homemade biscuit. We won't talk about making those. They're a little more complicated today. Pass Why don't you throw another one on there? Come oh, on. Yeah. Let's not mess around. He doesn't look like a sissy to me. little buttermilk biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> I can eat. Double, let me tell you something, Jim and biscuit. John. I can eat. Pour uh, a little of this on top of it, and I tell you what. Now, it don't you, get any better than that. Oh, man? yeah. Load me oh, up with right. the hot sauce. Then to top it off, to make it a little more southern, there throw a little go. hot sauce. Look at that. All I need now is a utensil. Here we go. Oh, Drum my roll. goodness. Be this careful. Is... That's going to be a little hot. <laughs> That's going to be a little spicy. <laughs> Smoke pouring off of it. What gave you that idea? Now, this is the fun part. We want to see you close this segment with a mouthful of that. <laughs> Oh my he's going God. Back he's not going to close. He's going back for more. <laughs> I'm going back for a second helping. <laughs> uh, next, we're going to make Guys, uh... <laughs> this is absolutely unbelievable. How can we get this recipe? Uh, we have this recipe on our webpage. We're at feastyboys.tv. And we've got this recipe and a bunch of our favorites on there. So pull it up. Feastyboys.tv. And if you'd like, you can link to that through our website, coldpizza.tv. It's Battle of the TV website. There you right. go. Guys, this is phenomenal stuff. Thank Keep you, it sir. coming. Very good. Thank and you good for, for you, too, right? He says with a wink <laughs> yeah. and a nudge. Okay, great. <laughs> Feasty Boys, always good to have you. We'll be back with more Cold Pizza Thank you. right after this. Mm.